everyone out there. Um, someone uh, on one of the other videos I posted about uh, my trip in Bolivia and Peru and Brazil uh, said they liked these glasses, so I figured I'd use this time to start uh, the Never Stop Building gear review series, where I'm gonna do a little review on each piece of gear that I that I happen to have, um, depending on time and whatnot. I spend probably more time than necessary researching what stuff to get, um, so it's probably worth sharing uh, that information with everyone else who's interested. So these are the uh, Jolbo Vermont Classics. Uh, they are a 125 year anniversary edition glacier sunglasses. This company, Jolbo, uh, was founded in 1888, I believe. And uh, for their 125th anniversary, they re-released these, sun these sunglasses, which are the same ones that they used, that they first started with. Um, and they're called the Vermont because a company in Vermont was distributing them to the US. Uh, and they were really popular in the 50s to the 70s. Um, they're amazing. It's so dark that um, when I switch back to my normal sunglasses, which are just like a, a random pair of uh, like wraparound Gucci shades, um, they, they don't even I don't even feel like I have sunglasses on. They're uh, so they're super dark and they definitely protect your eyes. Um, plus, they have these great things on the back, which keeps them from falling off your face if you're staring down in you know a mountain or whatnot. And these guys on the side, which protect your uh, sun from coming in. And this little guy up front, which protects the bridge of your nose. Although I do look like a bit like a raccoon after a long day outside. Um, yeah, these are great. And uh, they come with a little case. The case is actually kind of kind of bogus. It's metal and it has like a little felt inside. And so the sunglasses barely, I'll show you, they barely fit. You know, this doesn't hardly close and you have to put them upside down. So I think I'd probably, you know, upgrade the case at some point to like a zippered close, close, closable one. And you see, it's like it doesn't even close. The other thing that kind of pisses me off about them is that they, they don't hang easily on your shirt. Like this is as close as they get. Um, usually when I'm not wearing them, I hang them on my shirt. Um, so that's a little annoying, but I think the uh, the darkness makes up for that. Um, plus, they're, you know, obviously it you, makes you look like a character out of... Uh, you know, some post-apocalyptic, um, Mad Max is one of the, one of the other reviews mentioned this. Um, I, I think the style is really cool. And, and this, these are the ones that they had back 125 years ago and they, and they, but they have modern, um, can you see on the, I don't think this will focus. It says, uh, Spectron 4 is their, uh, UV shielding and whatnot. And uh, on their website, they're only $130. I think I got them for less than that on Amazon.com. Um, so yeah, th these are great shades. And uh, plus, you're, you'll look like kind of a crazy person like me if you if you get a set. So uh, if you have any other questions, post it in the comments, and uh, I'll I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks.